I am just so excited to be doing this video today. I actually had the launch on Countdown on my phone. If you guys didn't know already, I have been unboxing Zoella products for such a long time now, so I'm gonna leave all the links to my previous videos down in the description, but today, I am going to box the new Botanic Summer range by Zoella. So I bought uh, my range from Superdrug, but I also believe you can get them from Feel Unique and Ulta Beauty, so I'll leave the links down below. So let me just talk about this, because at Superdrug, they had a really good offer on for three for two, so I actually saved quite a bit of money on there. So I believe there's seven products in the range, and I've got the whole range so i'm going to tell you how much you can save if you buy all of it and shop with superdrug so yeah i'm just want to see what this is like i've heard so much about it on the phone on the phone <laughs> oh my gosh on the internet in interweb interweb internet not on the phone no so through superdrug um it was meant to cost me around 45 pounds i believe how much no 45.95 and with the deal, I saved £12, and then I bought express delivery, which was £5.50. So I spent £39.45, but you would get this all for about £36.45 if you just got standard delivery. Which, for seven products, I actually think is not bad. Right, let's give this an open and see. By the way, this is going to be, like, first reactions. I've not seen, smelt any of the products. So firstly, we have the uh, beautiful makeup bag. It's a cosmetics bag, not a makeup bag. It's very large. It feels really good quality, actually. Oh no, it's got that silly little plastic thing, hasn't it? Yep, it's pretty spacious inside, and it also has a waterproof inside, which is great because I always have to clean out my cosmetic bag. Bads. Oh my gosh, I can't speak today. Okay, not bad. So let me see how much this costs me. So you can get this for £10, but with the deal, it actually only cost me £7.40. Okay, next one. Oh, I have been so excited for this. I have to say, massive improvement on the packaging. I ended up not really liking the the glass bottle that the Christmas one came in. Just You couldn't really get it out, but this looks like a smoothie that's pretty cool so this is drench me bubble bath soak and it's quite large it's 500 ml right smell test oh okay i can't pinpoint the smell let me get some on my finger oh it smells fruity like really fresh it's not too strong actually let me see what it says on the back. So it says here on the back that it's got extracts of hydrating coconut water and radiance boosting lychee. Yeah, definitely can smell a hint of coconut, but it's not too strong. I'm loving this packaging. I think it's adorable and it's not like rubbish cardboard. Like it's good. I'm gonna have to do the bubble test, aren't I? Right, let's get my bowl. Joe, can you get me a bowl of water, please? Whilst Joe is kindly going to get me the water, so it's meant to cost £6.95 each, but in with the deal, it cost me £5.13. That is actually, hang on, let me see how much Radox charge for a bottle. Okay, when you compare it to Radox 500ml bottle, and I really like Radox, by the way, you can get it for £1. So it does make this one seem a little expensive. I'm just saying. Thank you, Joseph. Okay, here comes the bubble test. Oh, it's like pink as well. Give it a good stir. So it is bubbling up nicely. I've only put a little bit in there. So there you go. It is bubbling. Yeah, it's very light. This fringe isn't strong smelling. Not at all. So next in the box, we have the uh, Zoella Quench Me Body Sorbet. Oh, what's a body sorbet? Massage body sorbet into clean the skin until fully absorbed. So it's like a body lotion. I have actually, in the past, adored the Weather's body lotions. I think they're just very good. It's much, much thicker than before. That's actually really nice. Extremely hydrating, that. Give that a good 10 out of 10. She does a really good body lotion. The packaging is also sweet as well. Pink lid, palm trees with a bit of flowers like that next in here is make a splash moisturizing body wash so this 
I presume is a shower gel. It's, oh, it's really thick. Look at that. Oh, I just hit the microphone. But look at that. Whoa, that's really thick. Are you sure this is a body wash? Okay, let's give it a go. Again, very light. Look at that. So thick. Personally, I would have wanted more scent. That's just me because I like things quite overpowering. But if you're someone who likes things quite light to medium in the scent department, then this is actually quite a good range to try out. Right, we'll give myself a little rinse off. Ooh, it feels so silky when you like wash it off. We forgot to do the prices on the last two, didn't we? Hang on. So for the quenching sorbet, that uh, cost, should have cost £7 each, but within the deal, I got it for £5.17. And for the uh, Maker Splash, which is the body wash, it should be £6, but I got it for £4.43. Okay, I'll take that. Oh, we're going on to fragrance next. Okay, so 45ml. Give it a whiff. Let's sit on my arm for a bit. Again, it's still light. It's like, it's no Dior, but it's not meant to be like Dior. It's meant to be like, what, body mist, isn't it? It's very nice. It's so, it's quite cooling on the skin as well. It, it's such a pleasant scent. This is something I would do if I was like going to the gym, I'd just pop some of this on. Or if I was like popping to the shops, I don't want to smell too strong. I'd just put a bit of this on because, you know, if you're like wearing perfume all the time, but don't want to wear like your most expensive perfume all the time, then something like this is actually really good. And also a good fragrance to take on holiday. Oh, I can really smell it now. It develops on the skin. I actually read online that someone thought it smelled like manly, it, like the range smelled manly. It doesn't smell manly, ignore that comment. So I got the fragrance for uh, £5.91, but it was meant to cost me £8. That is a bargain for £5.91. Next in the box, we have Lagoon Love, which is a bath milk powder. Okay, so she actually did this at Christmas time and they came in little tubes. I actually quite liked them, um, especially good if you don't want bubble bath and you like, I don't know, you, you like more of a salt in the water. This is actually really good. So this was being sold for, I think, £3. Yeah, £3 each for a sachet, but I got it for £2.22. It's okay, like £2.22. I mean, you'd get probably get like three baths out of this probably. I got a lot out of my other ones I got at Christmas time, but I'm glad she's bought this back actually because I know a lot of you liked it. Next one, I think this is the final product. So final product is uh, Zoella So Soft Lip Oil. This is something different. She hasn't done a lip oil before. She's done lip balms, but not lip oils. Okay, so it's in a 8ml bottle, so quite large. And what's the price of this? So it's meant to be £5 each, but I got it for £3.09. Oh, it's like a lip gloss. It reminds me of the lip glosses I used to get when I was younger. It smells a bit like that, so it's a massive throwback. I'm going to give it a go. So with it smelling a little bit like lip gloss that I had when I was younger. It makes me question whether it's cheaply made. That is the only thing. Was it cheaply made? Because it really does remind me of a lip gloss that I used to get in my magazine, magazines, magazine makeup. You know, the makeup I got in magazines when I was younger. There we go, guys. So that is the brand new Zoella Botanics range. I'll leave the link to everything down in the description. I absolutely think the two products you need to get is the body sorbet and the body wash. They're so creamy, hydrating, they're lightly fragranced and they just smell, just smell really good. Drop me a comment down below which one was your favorite and whether you agree with me, disagree with me. I really wanna hear your thoughts down below. Also go and follow me on Instagram. As you guys know, Instagram TV has just launched. I'm on there. You can watch unboxing videos of mine on there too. I'm thinking about doing the um, subscription boxes as a group on this channel. Then maybe opening the subscription boxes one by one on my Instagram TV. So if you want to see that, go over to my Instagram and follow me over there. But as always guys, please make sure that you link, like and subscribe and I'll see you next time for another video. Goodbye.